How you all doing guys? Welcome to Van Clan. Thank you for checking out this video. It's much appreciated. If you do enjoy this video, please do hit subscribe. Now, we get asked this question almost daily and it is what is the best van to live in full time so instead of dming you all individually we've put together this video of the top 10 recommended vans to live in from us now these go in no particular order nor do they come in a particular budget each one that we talk about can be picked up for as little as five grand all the way up to 200 grand with a uh, conversion built in straight out of the factory so Let's just jump straight in and first on the list is one you've definitely heard of and that is the Mercedes Sprinter. The quintessential conversion vehicle has to be the Mercedes Sprinter, the ultimate off-grid home. Mercedes Sprinter conversions come in all shapes and sizes and are usually the go-to vehicle for many conversion companies thanks to their durability and power. If you're looking for a sturdy base vehicle that is still reliable even when you get into hundreds of thousands of miles territory, then a Sprinter is the van for you. Mercedes are a global name in the motoring world, so whether you break down in Morocco or lose your exhaust in Kent, parts and spares aren't hard to get hold of, which can be useful when you're in a pickle. There's also lots of aftermarket products and specifically made gear that you can buy to fit your Sprinter making it one of the most reliable vans to live in full time. You can pick these up fairly cheap if you don't mind large miles, or you can go all out with a brand new $200,000 build from the likes of Nomad Vans. If that isn't your thing, then maybe we should go a little bit smaller. So second on our list is the classic VW Transporter Bus. From the SoCal surf days through to today's digital nomads, the Volkswagen bus is an iconic vehicle immersed with van life culture. And when you take a look at these buses up close, it's not hard to see why. The early VW buses aren't in production anymore, so parts can be a little tricky to come by or expensive to purchase. Smart individuals and small businesses with access to a 3D printer are started to make some of the smaller interior parts themselves, while other companies specialize in replacing VW bus engines with 100% electric options, turning your classic rides into incredibly cheap maintenance vehicles. These buses are loved today just as much as they were almost 60 years ago and remain the quintessential van for that summer of love feeling. These are perfect for a single traveler or a couple traveling on the road that don't mind keeping their life minimal. Lots of people around the world know how to work on these and the later transporters are very reliable and spacious, making you rest at ease when you're driving across countries. Now coming up, number three on our list is one our writers actually use and that is the Vauxhall Movano. <laughs> If you're an avid reader of our website, you may know that our very own writers and full-time van lifers, Seven Rose, actually use the Movano as their full-time home. They've gone almost 14 months living on the road throughout Europe in this absolute beautiful conversion. They bought a 2003 model with 90k miles on the clock and with a fiberglass maxi roof. It's incredibly tall, so tall in fact that Rose herself can do a headstand in it and it served them well in their current van life journey. The best thing about a fiberglass roof is that it's easy to cut through and even easier to fiberglass back over if you make a mistake or change your build plan. They've had to do this pretty recently when they removed their beloved log burner and vehicle wise the van is a dream to run and it's just the right length to not have to worry about finding extra large parking spaces. If you don't need the extra length of a sprinter and want something tall enough for a fixed bed then this is the best van to live in. You can see they've done a cracking job with their self-conversion and because they're so cheap to pick up, many van lifers have some extra cash to use for their interior. If you want some more information on this vehicle, definitely head over to their Instagram, which is at Vincent Van Life. They've got some really cool inspiration and they're constantly on it. So definitely drop them a few messages if you have some questions. And that brings us on to number four, the VW Crafter. The VW Crafter, like the Sprinter and the Movano, is a commercial vehicle for transporting goods. Because of its spacious nature and the fact it's a quality build from a name that you can trust, it makes a top contender for the best van to live in for many van dwellers around the globe. 
Parts for crafters are much easier to obtain than their retro cousins, and they're still in production today, so don't worry about visiting a garage on the other side of the world on your travels. These vans can cope with rough terrain just as well as they cruise down motorways and country lanes. And they're our top choice if you're looking for a long wheelbase vehicle that doesn't cost the earth. You can usually find these cheaper than a Mercedes Sprinter, but because it's a VW, many of these are hard to find outside of Europe. And because they are very boxy, many van lifers find them easy to convert. Adding insulation, sound deadening, walling, and everything else is a breeze. And it makes a first good buy for upcoming van lifers. So coming in at number five is the Ford Transit. A British classic and the van of choice for white van men everywhere. The Ford Transit could be considered the best van to live in because it's a universally renowned make and build that is cheap to pick up and built to last, providing that it's been looked after of course. The Ford Transit camper is usually a medium wheelbase vehicle, so it's a little smaller than the likes of the Sprinter and the Movano, but you can get a long wheelbase for those that want that extra space for onboard showers and stuff. The Ford Transit camper conversion is a natural choice for the van lifer in training that doesn't have a massive budget but wants a quality van to get them going on their travels. It gets a hard rap from some people in the business but we think that they're great runners and their shape makes them easy to add wood panelling and interior features without too much hassle. It might not suit if you're looking for extra headroom so try out a few different models before you buy. The newer ones can get expensive but dang do they look incredibly modern, almost like something out of Transformers. Now coming on to our next, some of you will say it's not a van, but it's really, really cool and one that we recommend picking up if you've got the money, and that is a classic American school bus. I know it's not a van, but you can't have a list based on alternative living methods without including everyone's dream tiny home. Ask any American traveler and they'll tell you that this little yellow bus is the best van to live in because of its space, its durability and because converted buses look damn right epic. Think about how many times these buses get used day in day out when they're in service. They're kept in good nick by the schools and built to last because they have to get the kids from A to B on time every day. Parts are readily available because American schools still use them and their bright yellow colour means that you'll never lose track of where you parked. Why do we like this little adventure bus so much? Well, they can take on pretty much anything that you throw at them, and they look very homely inside once converted. The windows give ample light, and they're high enough to have a fixed bed without losing tons of living space. We've seen so many different school bus conversions out there that we've actually lost count, which means that there's a network of bus lifers out there who can help you out if you're stuck on want to purchase or having a mechanical problem. Now next on our list, one that you might not have considered being here, but it's the Renault Traffic. <music> Renault, Citroen and Vauxhall vans are usually very much alike. In fact, they're pretty much the same vehicle with a slightly different exterior and badge. Take German conversion company Campania, who have turned a run-of-the-mill goods vehicle into a camper with an attitude showing us the possibilities that can come with purchasing one of these vehicles. In its form, the standard traffic van isn't the best vehicle for long-term off-grid living because of its height, but it's perfect for the weekend warrior who likes to get out whenever they can. If you buy a ready-made conversion or are thinking about adding a pop-top into the equation, then everything changes. Being able to stand up in your home is one of the things that we believe is essential if you're on the road 24-7, and the addition of extra height would undoubtedly make us reconsider getting one ourselves. If you've been following us on Instagram or the van life scene on Instagram, you have definitely seen this vehicle upcoming, and it is one from our American friends over the pond that we absolutely love and want over here in the UK, and it's the Sportsmobile 4x4 Classic. This van is an absolute beast, and if you're looking for something that will serve you just as well on rough terrain as it does on the freeway, then this is the vehicle for you. The Sportsmobile takes a Ford cutaway body and molds it with a reinforced fiberglass shell to give a unique look that's perfect for off-roading and enough space to live out of the van full time. This van includes all of the high-spec upgrades needed to take your vehicle on the rockiest tracks, including a ground clearance of a whopping 6.5 inches. 
Inside the Sportsmobile, it utilizes a pop top to give you extra headroom, meaning you can stand up without a problem. The Sportsmobile Classic 4x4 comes in at $40,000 with plenty of added extras available. It's not the cheapest van on the market, but if you're looking for a camper van to take you wherever your heart desires, then this could be a great investment. Now almost coming up to the end here, number nine on our list is the Ram Promaster, or also known in Europe as the Fiat Ducato. The Promaster is becoming a significant competitor to the Mercedes Sprinter and Ford Transit vans, and it's worth considering if you plan on living in your van all year round. One factor that makes the Ram Promaster a huge contender for the best van to live in is that it is wide enough to fit a standard full-size bed widthways, unlike in a Mercedes Sprinter or Ford Transit where you would lose some length. This can save you loads of space in your conversion for other components in your camper van build. The Promaster is also the only one of these three vehicles to have front-wheel drive, making it easy to drive, handle and park. The inside of a Ram Promaster can be converted to meet your wildest dreams. Everything you ever need for an epic adventure can be squeezed inside with ease. You can even buy DIY IKEA-like kits for it. The only thing left to add is your own gear. Oh, and a toilet should you want to poop off the grid. Now, coming in at number 10, one that will blow your mind, and unfortunately this one is a concept, but you never know, it might come into the works in the next couple of years, is the Heimer Vision Venture. <laughs> The last one on our list, and we might as well go out with a bang, is currently a concept vehicle which may be coming to the public by 2023, and it's the Heimer Vision Venture. Originally shown at Dusseldorf last year, it blew us away with how incredible this thing was. Based on a brand new 2020 Sprinter, it had custom bodywork, interior fit for a king, and a back door that slides down into a balcony. Built with 4x4 tires, a snorkel, and all of the off-road accessories you can imagine, this thing will tackle anything you can chuck at it. It's rumored to be around the $250,000 mark should it be released, and you can see why when you take a look at the inside. It looks like you're in a five-star hotel. Heck, it even has steps up into the electric pop-top. This thing is an absolute beast and one of the best camper vans we've seen so far. Let's just hope Heimer and Mercedes actually launch this thing because we'd love to see it on the road. So there you have it, a quick video showcasing the 10 best campers to live in full time. Let us know if you have any comments below or if you want to get into the nitty gritty stuff, definitely DM us on Instagram. As per usual, I hope you subscribe and I hope to see you in the next video. Peace.